Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've got a few packages in a box to open today, all on the same theme. So buckle in, it may be a bit more of a long video. Uh, you may want to get a coffee before you watch this one. Uh, but uh, yeah, I think you'll be interested in them. I'm quite interested to see what's in them. Uh, sorry about the shadows. I'll try and keep it as to a minimum as much as I can. But it is very dark in the UK today, very rainy, very miserable. So I've had to put the lights on, which I don't like doing, until I can get some proper lighting to light my desk up. It's unfortunate we're going to have shadows. So let's have a look at the first one. Shall we look at the box first? Let's have a look at the box first. Just move these two out of the way. Okay, so this was a little bit of a trial buy, just to see what we're getting um, it's not actually listed as diamond painting it's listed as an essential oils carrying case for 30 bottles of 10 millimeters so we'll see I'm not sure whether my diamond painting like little files will fit in this but we'll see how we go okay um, it was on the <laughs> Vipon app again so I've been using Goldbuns um and it was supposed to be 14.99 and i got it for half price seven pound 49 so let's get into it and have a look and see what we've got um, i think i have seen we're going to have the pretty plastic bag. okay so i think i have seen um this similar design on some of the new um, diamond painting containers which are the little square one. If you can hear any sniff sniff sniffing. We've got Millie joining us on the bed today and um, she's sat looking over my shoulder. So okay let's have a look at this. It's a nice material. I just love the lovely bright colours on it with all your butterflies and your hearts and your flowers. It's got a nice little carrying handle with uh, a strengthening strap there which quite good okay so let's have a look and see if there isn't any bottles or anything in it it is just the empty case okay so these hmm what have we got one two three four five one two three four so yeah it's got 30 uh, little holes in this sort of like what is it foam rubber it's quite soft actually it's not as um thick as some of the ones that you get in the diamond painting cases but you can see there so we'll see whether our diamond painting bottles fit in there in a bit when we've looked at the other things it comes with your little uh, netted pocket at the top the same and this one actually comes with oh so it comes with the uh stickers that go on your essential oils so we've got clove and orange and parma rosa uh, oh on guard i'm not sure what that one is peace focus rosemary patch tule citronella so yeah you've got a lot of uh, nice labels there um, and there's a few blank ones as well look with colors on so you can make up your own as well so if you are wanting it for essential oils or for even nail varnishes or something like that possibly fit in there I'm not sure on the height of them you'd have to try them out but I've got this for diamond painting so yeah okay for £7.50 it's quite a nice little case I mean if these don't fit I can always take um, the foam out and just use it as like a pencil case or something I'll put diamond painting tools and um, it's quite a nice deep case there let me just give you some quick measurements on it so it is we measure the outside so we're roughly 22-ish centimeters 22 and a bit centimeters sort of like going from if i just do the lid so that's 20 centimeters but you've got a little bit more for the zip and then that is 16 centimetres, 6 inches uh, with the handle. You've just got a couple of centimetres more, so it's about 7 inches. So it's quite a nice compact little case. Okay, I just thought this design was just so colourful, summery. Okay, so let's have a look at the next item I got. Item number two, you will see a theme going on. And again, I used some coupons, and these are 
get rid of my crinkly bag. Okay, these are those little drawers. Now it said that it was normally £15.98 for one, which oh, they don't want to come out. Let me get some scissors. Okay, I have seen them round about the £8 mark for one. These are empty, or they're supposed to be empty, so I'm presuming they will be. Okay, I've seen quite a few people unbox these and open. Um, so because there were, I had a Vipon coupon, um, if you've got any questions or if you want to know any more about Vipon, if you uh, just uh, put me a question in the link down below. I have no affiliation with them, I don't get any commission or anything, but it's just a coupon app that I use and uh, I like to pass on uh, anything that I've saved um, or any bargains that I've found to yourselves with my little videos. So just pop those out of the way. So yeah, this is um, these little doors. So because they were normally £15.98 um, and it was half price, I ordered two of them. So I got two for £15.98. So £7.99 each basically. And as I say, I think you can get them for £7.99 each. Uh, when they're empty and then you've got your choice I can't find the opening on this one <laughs> get the scissors Liz I'm going to be sat here all day trying to talk while I look for the opening oh dear me that's better right so I'm not sure whether these look smaller in real life um or whether it's just sort of an illusion when you see other people unboxing them. I thought they were slightly bigger than this. But it's supposed to hold your bottles or um, your little tic tac containers, or as I say, those little individual square containers seem to be really popular at the moment. They're just basically a little drawer. Um, there's no dividers, albeit there are, uh, if you can see, look, you've got the little edges there for the dividers, but. Uh, Oh dear, what's the matter? There's not actually centres any dividers. Let me just see what Millie's up to or what they're saying. What? What are you telling me? <coughs> okay, I'm back. Millie has just decided that she had something buried underneath the bed. Uh, so I've had to get her down and get on my hands and knees because I've put some stuff underneath the bed and it's got stuck there. And so, yeah, we've both just been on our hands and knees looking under the bed uh, to find a chew stick, which she now has. So if you hear any munching noises, it's not me, it's Millie. <laughs> Millie is our little Scottish terrier or terrierist, should I say at the moment. She's a, a little uh, so-and-so. OK, so, yeah, so these are your little... Uh, drawers. I mean, you, you don't have to put bottles or anything in them. You could literally use them as pencil cases, use them for paper clips, stationery, business cards, anything like that. Uh, as far as I know, they do slot together. So I do believe that these do slot on top, do they? Yeah, they do. I'm not sure which way around they go. Oh, they go that way, look. So they slot on top. Oh no, I haven't quite got it. Um, <laughs> but yeah, they'll slot on top like that. Or they will slot sideways if you want them side by side. If I can just get that in there. And just uh, see how this goes. I'm trying not to make too much noise. Oops. Oh, that's it, yeah. That just slots in there and you have got uh, your little screw holes at the back so if you did want to hang them on a wall you can do so you know they're quite handy so okay so I'll leave those two together for the moment and then of course the third thing that I bought now I'm not sure whether this works out cheaper or more expensive buying it all separately but I thought I would order some bottles and these have cost me uh, I've ordered 90 and these have cost me £7.34. So we'll see if they fit in our little containers that we've bought. Otherwise, this will be a fail. Um, and hopefully then I've saved you some money from trying to buy them separately. Because I've had a, <laughs> a go at doing them myself to see if it works out any cheaper. 
Oops, if we get into this, goodness me, they certainly wrapped them very well, so well done for that. I'm not intending them to get broken, so hopefully they're not. Let's just get this cut open here, and this cut open here. Oops, lots of squirrely tape. Right, what have we got here? Labels. Oh, yeah, oh wow, okay, oh brilliant. So they've actually sent us, uh, if you can see that, uh, a set of stickers of DMC numbers. Wow. So we've got one down to 39 there, and then we've got uh, DMC number 150 up to 5290, 5291. Um, I've seen up to 5200, so I'm not quite sure what those numbers are. Uh, maybe you can tell me what they are. Um, and then we've got A to Z as well. So that's a really good sticker. They're quite um, quite a price just for those. So that's uh, a good extra. Oh, and then we've got some 1 to 50 stickers. Three lots of 1 to 50 round stickers to go on the top. So that's quite like a nice little bonus. Let's get these out. Looks like they're packed in the 30s. Okay. That out the way so yeah i didn't think that was bad for seven pound 34 for 90 bottles so let's just have a look at one pack we don't need to open all of them and let's see if they fit in our new cases this will be interesting okay i do like to play around so yes they do so let's see if we can get Thirty in here. I'll put it on the screen down below. Um, what thirty bottles cost? So thirty bottles will cost what approximately? Uh, let me think. Let me think. Seven pound thirty-four divided by three. Well, two pound fifty would be each. Two pound fifty for thirty would be seven pound fifty. So it's about seven pound. Oh, seven pound two pound 45 then for a set of 30 bottles and then what did i say 7.99 was it the case 7.49 the case so 7.49 uh 8.49 9.49 so it's working out roughly uh, about seven pound 95 ish uh, seven pound eight, no, seven pound ninety five ish to get the case and to buy the bottle separately. So you know you, you maybe can get it cheaper. I'm not sure, but you get to choose what bottles you want. Um, and it's just a bit of fun trying out to see whether they would actually fit or not. So yeah, we've got a thirty bottle case there. So I'm quite happy with that. So I say that's worked out about nine pound. Um. What did I say? £9.95-ish. Uh, they're quite the nice, um, tough plastic bottles, but they are the good sort of softer plastic lids, which I prefer, because I don't like the squeak when you get the hard plastic with the hard plastic. It's like nails down on a blackboard. But also these are a bit more robust because they don't crack when they're dropped. Be careful with these, because obviously these will with them being a rigid plastic or hard plastic. But yeah, so that's a new case that I've got with uh, the bottles in. So quite happy with that. Okay, and I do like it. It is a nice summery colour. I think when I'm kitting up with that one, that'll definitely make me smile. Okay, so now we've got these. And let's see if these bottles fit and how many it can hold. <laughs> okay, so I'm not sure how much these cost with the bottles in them. Again, it looks like they do fit. So what can we get? One, two, three, four, oops, five. Can only get five. So hmm, okay not bought any with the bottles in so this is a new one for me okay one two three four five oh i don't like them if they're not in 
more straight lines. Ooh, no, I'm not liking that. Okay. So do we only get three rows? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it looks like you can get extras in, but I got specimen lines. Hmm. Okay. So what have we got now? One, two, three. No, it won't get four. So they're going to be slightly off the line. So what have we got? 3, 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So we've got 20 bottles in there. Hmm. Okay. So 20 bottles. What did we say? So they were 7 99 and then £2.45. So, so £9.50-ish for 20 bottles in one of these little drawers so I'm not sure I'll uh, you know, have to look what the other companies charge for one of these but that's if you want to do it yourself buy it all separately obviously the beauty of doing it this way is you can put whatever you want in these maybe you don't want lots of spare bottles um, but yeah I just wanted to try them out and see but they obviously are the same size as the ones that uh, I've seen other people unboxing because they have fitted the standard little bottles in um, and one of these containers, the, the standard ones that you get um, in most of the boxes that are similar to this, and they get between seven and eight packs of 200 drills. So that's between 1,400 and 1,600 drills in one of these. So you've got quite a, a big uh, amount to put in there. So let's just put some more in here. I mean, you can kick your know, drills up in these, and if you're just wanting it as a little drawer, if you've just got one that's maybe just 20 um, colours, it would be quite a nice one to do. Okay, so let's just pop that in there. It may be easier. I mean, it is, oops, let's just open the next packet. It may be. Oh, no, I don't like Mr. Fan. <laughs> may be easier to just buy it all at once but I'm sure if you shop around maybe you can get some of the uh, little bottles cheaper and um, maybe you can get these cheaper it's just the ones that I saw at the time and thought right I'm going to get those and just see um, how it works out and just a way of trying them okay so we've got 20 in the last one two, three six nine ten eleven twelve thirty five fifty six seven eight eighteen so let's see if we can get the other two in there. So, yeah, that's the extra two. So, yeah, you can't get any more in there. Would you fit another one in there? No, no, because the lid wouldn't shut. Okay, so that's your drawers then. So we've got 40 bottles in there. Um, and your two containers and we've got 30 in there and then these spare ones if you remember I bought these lipstick holders a while back and I thought right well, I'll get the 90 because then I wasn't sure how many of these held uh, and I wasn't sure if they'd fit in there but I knew they would fit in these so I'm just going to fill these up now as well and say these are actually lipstick holders but if you remember, oh, quite a while back, I did actually buy one of these as a set um, with diamond painting pens because your pens fit in this end and it did come with the bottles. But again, I found this one is actually a lot, lot cheaper to buy it without the bottles as a lipstick stand. Okay, so it's not been used before. So I'll pop these in here because I've got quite a few specials coming up. Um, the wreaths tend to use a lot of specials and I think this one holds 18 yeah 369 18 yeah so this is an 18 container and it's quite nice if you are doing the wreaths or specials um, just to pop 
these in and I've still not got enough look because I've got another one okay so that's an 18 that I've done and then I've only got two here so I need another two four six because this little one only holds eight but uh, yeah so just some ways of buying everything separate just seeing if we can pop that out the way make it that little bit cheaper um I think it's probably just pop those away working out about the same amount of money this is definitely a lot cheaper uh, to buy this I will put all the links down below um in my description uh, this is definitely a lot cheaper to buy them separately. These are probably are working out about the same. But the thing is, you've then got the choice as to what you put in them, what you want to do with them. Or if you do just want the empty case, say like for this, um, or if you do do aromatherapy or anything like that in bead making, then these are great. Okay, well, I, I think that's um, everything that I've got done. I, that's quite a nice bonus, getting all the... DMC numbers there in a nice sheet with uh, all those on and uh, then I can just label these up uh, 1 to 18 on those I've only got 40 going those but I may buy some more to stack I'm not sh I'm not sure whether I'll be using these as much I don't know maybe if it's 20 but I do tend to like things in nice rows rather than in squidgy rows that move about so if it's a bit dark while I'm diamond painting, I know that this is number six at the end here and that uh, this one is number nine there. You know, I, I know where they are, whereas with these, they tend to slip about a bit. You have to actually look. <laughs> That's me being lazy. OK, well, if you've got any questions um, or if you've got any ideas with these, then please let me know in the comments down below. Um, if you've enjoyed having a look at these, then please give me a thumbs up. It's much appreciated. And if you want to come back and see me possibly using these and see what I get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner here and the little bell next to it, you'll be notified when my next videos come out. So thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.